the Adler Planetarium is very proud to say that we have reacquired our uh, long lost original planetarium projector. In 1930, the Adler Planetarium was founded as the first planetarium in the Western Hemisphere. And to, uh, to showcase the planetarium capabilities, we needed a projector um, in our theater. So the projector was the first of its kind in the Western Hemisphere. The way the projector worked, we, we often just kind of boil it down to it's a star projector, but it did so much more than stars. It had uh, two spherical pieces on a, a middle spine. And so the two spherical pieces had bright light bulbs on the inside, the light shone through plates and lenses. You could do the sky above the entire earth. The brightest stars had their own projectors and planets had their own projectors. The moon did, the sun did, and all of these individual objects and their motions uh, could be simulated with this amazing piece of machinery. It's amazing to think that this thing must have sounded alive when it was working because you could you could have it have the whole machine turn and you could probably hear the little little tiny clicks of all those little shutters and things as this thing was operating we we actually didn't know where it was from about 1990 to about 2010 or so a solar engineer in ohio had it in 2008, during the presidential debates, John McCain was mentioning pork projects during one of the debates, and he singled out mentioning uh, refurbishment of our planetarium, which, side note, we never got that money. Um, and he said, and the Adler Planetarium wants $3 million for an overhead projector. Well, needless to say, this all blew up. It, it finally settled down and everything, but the guy in Ohio had watch he'd heard about that and he said hey by the way uh i can help you if you need mechanical help with your zeiss mark six by the way i have your zeiss mark two and, <laughs> and we went what <laughs> and it wasn't until earlier this year when his son got in touch with us and said would you like your projector back we went yes please a piece of adler history has come home to chicago um and i was just thrilled to be part of the team that helped recover it and uh, something I never thought I would actually be able to do in my life. Thought, thought this thing was lost forever, but it's now back home. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.